special edition of the Unsupervised Pitmaster. Hey, look, what we're going to do today is something really cool. Paul and I at uh, BRQ Bacon and Fig. Um, almost every day we're, we're cooking chicken, a lot of chicken. And for example, on Friday, I think we did 205 chicken halves. So we've come up with this thing like while we're doing chicken, we call it friggin' chicken. We actually have some chairs and we sit at the table and it's almost like the view where we talk about really, you know, really interesting stuff. We always talk about, you know, three things that you would do, three things you would want to travel to or vehicles you'd want to own or people you'd want to meet. And then we have, uh, you know, a serious question because the two of us are real. You would never expect us to get together or, or get along. A born again, on fire, Jesus loving Christian and a gay guy and it, who I love. And, and it is just, an, there are some incredible conversations that we have about all kinds of stuff. Abortion, um, death penalty, uh, gay marriage. You know, we, act, we, we talk about all this kind of stuff and share things. And it's great insight for both of us. Anyways, the other thing that we do is we pick a featured ingredient. And we say, okay, let's, let's cook something with this ingredient. You know, kind of like chopped. What kind of dish would you do? And it always ends up that at the end, we're like modifying each other's and coming up with this really cool deal, which is what we came up with that I'm going to cook today. Now, this is a two-day process cook because what I had to do yesterday was I had to grill the chuck roast. I had to grill the scallops. I had to boil the uh, crab boil the potatoes. And we're going to build a breakfast deal that is just, I, I think it's going to be amazing. I've been excited about this the whole time. Okay. So, what I've done is I've got a little foil pan. I put some plastic in it, and um, I, we got those pre-made pie shells. So I, I, I fitted the pie shell down in there. You'll see why I'm doing that. Here's what we're gonna do. Got a little bit of liquid butter. I'm gonna put a little bit of liquid butter in the bottom of the, bottom of the pie shell, okay? Then I'm going to put our crab boil potatoes. Okay, these are crab boiled, boiled uh, crab boil, and a little bit of Tony's seasoning. So we're gonna line the bottom of it with with these guys. Next step, I'm gonna add a little bit of Parmesan cheese on top of that, so that melts on top of the potatoes. Okay, so we got a little Parmesan cheese. We're gonna do a little surf. These are scallops that I grilled on the grill yesterday with, um, these have a habanero mango um, rub on them. They are, they, are, they, are, um, they are amazing. Here's, you, it, doesn't, it doesn't really look like anything amazing, but it is incredible. Okay, this is the chuck roast that I, Finished off, I put in some uh, some beef broth, finished it off in the oven, got it real tender, just fall apart, breaking apart, so I broke all that up. And I added that to the onions, um, poblano pepper, um, a, uh, Brussels sprouts, and mushrooms that I sauteed. I just, I sauteed those down on the grill yesterday, just nice and soft and caramelized. So that's, that's this whole mixture right here. Okay, so. And again, this is the first time we're doing this, so we're going to see how it goes. So I'm going to take this mixture and I'm going to put it into, into the pan. And I'm going to kind of scrunch it down just a little bit because we got something, we got something really amazing coming. Avocado. Okay, we're going to scoop out an avocado and we're going to put it right on top of all that. Okay, now what I think I'll do, I think I'll kind of pack around a little bit. Around, ooh, that's good right there, yeah! Ooh, like that, only that, showing, so we can see what Okay, and then we'll go. Okay, so we got all right, now this is intended to be the day after, so it's a little bit of a breakfast dish. So we gotta have our eggs. All right, now watch this, this is over the top. 
into the cup of the avocado. You see what I'm saying? Okay. A little bit of seasoning. We got some Tony's with extra spice because we're down here in Louisiana. We love Tony's. Oh man, I'm wondering. I'm wondering how this is all going to come together. It's making me nervous. It's making me nervous. Okay, a little bit of pepper jack on top to seal the deal. Okay. This one's body positive, Paul. Of the, oh, got it out of the mold. Ooh, 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 this one is leaky freaky. Okay, 450 degrees. That one's a mess. That fat guy is a mess. Okay, I'll tell you what I'm gonna do. A little bit of butter. Fat guy, fat guy, I wanna seal you up. Some Parmesan cheese. Kind of make it hide up all the imperfections. And we'll even put some Parmesan on the other guy too. Okay. Okay, in the oven, 15 minutes. They didn't stay together like we thought, but I'm gonna tell you what, these are gonna be good. Ha! Ha 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 Y'all number two is gonna be a lot easier. Okay, next time we do this on a cookie sheet. Oh! See, on unsupervised, we show everything here. We show everything. There it is. There it is. Now let's do the let's do the inspection cut. There it is. I, I gotta try this. I'm going for the part with the egg and the avocado. Oh. Oh. Egg, avocado. Chuck roast, crab oil potatoes. <sighs> Don't do this at home. Oh, it'll ruin you. It'll ruin you. Unbelievable flavor. Unbelievable. All that grilled meat, goodness, onions, Brussels sprouts, scallops. Mm. Home freaking run. Home run. Mm.